wobble champ. He's hurt bad. This dude needs to grab. He needs to rest. He has to do something. He cannot take another shot like that. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting it over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did. Okay, you ready? Round two. Ready? Go. Round two underway. Nice. <laughs> Trying to establish that jab once again. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Pretty significant welt to the left side. Relax, relax. Keep your head. Able to check that kick as well. And he landed the right hand there. Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Ooh, blocks the shot. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Oh, a the strike to the body. I mean, this fight is close to being stopped. That was a massive shot to the body. That will land it clean. That punch, no good. Nice job by the fighter here to continue to block the shots coming his way. You think he's trying to sort of fatigue his opponent here a little bit? He's kind of watching and seeing everything that's happening in front of him. Later, you'll see him start to throw counters after blocking shots. Just misses with the jab. Well, he was a little bit lackluster in round one. You can't say the same here in this second round. He has really picked up the pace an uptick in the aggression and the output, and starting to find his range here in the pocket. Just missed with the left there. Looked like a good knee to the body, but it's blocked. Oh! oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press it. He's got to go chase that finish down now. He's in trouble. He's getting lit up. Big elbow there. Oh, what a shot to the body. His opponent Well, he's been good to and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Throwing that. In there. His opponent could be out of here soon, DC. He's almost done. I mean, when you get hit with a shot like that, you don't know whether to run, hide, grab, or wrestle. He's a, he, I mean, he's confused. He's as confused as he was on his first test in elementary school. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, an elbow! Dude's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, 
He might be out. Huge elbow there. Oh. Just over three minutes to go in round three. Right under the elbow. Body hit later. And now he's got his opponent hurt. Switching stances here. Big left hook coming, it's blocked. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes. Oh, huge elbow! He needs to oh. Oh. Just digs into the box. Nicely done there to keep his hands up and block that strike. He's got to protect that cut if he wants to keep the doctor out. He's got to protect the cut, John. But he's oh! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish his fight. Oh! And just like that, the fight is over. He got him! A near-perfect strike to end the fight and end the night for his opponent, who candidly may not have even seen that shot coming. So just the way he drew it up, exactly what he told us during fight week, played out here on fight night. He found a little opening in his opponent's defense and barged right through it to get the big knockout win. It is a welterweight matchup between Tony Ferguson and George Rush St. Pierre. him to fight this fight and make it as easy as possible. Nice strike. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Oh! Couple of chins here being tested early. Nice connection there by Tony Ferguson. You're probably glad you never had to prepare for a fighter like this in your day. I've never seen anything like that, and I'm not sure there's anyone like that going up in the weights. Tony Ferguson does not give you any idea of what you're facing. When you're in there, you're confused. He doesn't give you any type of pattern inside the octagon. Man, he's just got a great feel for the striking realm early in this one. The timing is on point. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up. Whiffs on that offering. Oh, nice knee to the body. Very nice. Able to land with the left hand. Oh, a 
has had a big knee to the body. We'll see if he can follow up. Oh! Back and forth we go. Oh! Vicious combo there! Oh, nice right hand. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Man, he's timing his shots nicely. It's like Tom Brady out there. He hasn't missed the target. I mean, you... Oh! He's hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, yes. Now we're going. He's going after the head. That one landed clean. Oh, knee strike right to the midsection there. Oh, straight right. Look at the whip action that comes from throwing that kick. And both guys really throwing with authority. Oh, oh he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh! And he continues to work the body here. El Kukui gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Got to find a way to move those feet. That horn sounds means we have reached the end of round one. All right, let's check out some of the action DC and... Ready? Round two here. Oh, he landed that knee to the midsection. <laughs> His opponent's really on the ropes. His opponent's on beat Street. He's hurt so bad. I don't know what he's gonna do to stay in this fight. Just missed with the left there. Nice. Oh! St. Pierre's lower jaw now started to show signs of swelling. Oh, and he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbow. Finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. That one is going to end the fight. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Back to the feet. Oh, oh, oh. That's a good DC. He massive, is massive hook lands. And his opponent seems to be on his way out of the fight. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body. Oh. Yeah, it looks a little wobbly on his feet. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Don't finish his fight. Right, guys, landing with conviction now. Oh! Back to the feet. Whoa! He's in trouble. Oh, he's hurt bad. Ferguson goes down. He's getting lit up right now. Oh. Just an absolutely gorgeous shot to spell the end for his opponent. Crowd is absolutely loving it. He gets the near-perfect land. I'm not even sure his opponent saw it coming, but just the way he drew it up here tonight, saw that little crack of an opening and barged right through it to get the knockout. Well, hard to perform much better than he did tonight. A huge knockout under the lights. They'll be talking about that one for some time.